Right now, hundreds of people are lining up across Central Florida to get their hands on sandbags. This is the line that wrapped around Camping World Stadium in Orlando this afternoon. Channel 9's Mike Manzoni live outside that stadium. And Mike, Orlando City officials don't expect to run out of sand. Right, but they have already run out of bags. They've even put up a sign that says no bags there. City officials say you can still come and get sand here through 7 o'clock tonight, but you need to bring your own bag. If you don't have one, they say just bring a pillowcase or anything that holds up to 40 pounds. With Hurricane Irma just hours away from hitting Florida, hundreds of people are rushing to fill up sandbags. The city of Orlando handed out 20,000 sandbags within the past 48 hours, and people are still lining up. I'm expecting a lot of wind, a lot of water. If you plan on picking up sandbags in Orlando, get ready for a long wait. Anita Smith waited in line for more than five hours. It was crazy. Matthew Waringa waited about as long. It looked like we were tailgating for a football game. They have plenty of sand in Orlando, but some cities have none left. Ocoee, Winter Park, and Maitland ran out yesterday, and that list could grow. Like a needle in a haystack trying to find sand. Okay. Wearinga drove to Camping World Stadium to fill up a few bags for himself and then decided to help others. I've been shoveling in um, sandbags for like about the last two and a half hours, three hours. After he's done here, he has a lot to take care of at home. And it's not only his home he's worried about right now. A pregnant wife, she's eight months pregnant, so concerned about that. If you didn't have a chance to pick up sandbags today, you can still get some tomorrow in some cities. We have a list of all the locations we know of on WFTV.com. For now, we're live in Orlando. Mike Benzoni, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.